part of the topic is hair. Okay. Right. Wait, why are you kind of clicking? Oh, God. oh, hey guys. Welcome. So, um, back in my office, as you can see, I've decorated a little bit. <laughs> Are you trying to cover it with your hair? So, I, I did a, a challenge. It's not really a challenge. It's like, basically, you, you drink a few beers and you get a shirt. Just just a few. A few. Just, you can look it up. It's the tap room thing. That leads us into our in goals for this year. That does. So, I actually have a little journal here. Uh, this is actually... Uh, well, it's just for the channel in general, and so I write down like ideas about videos and such. Well, I have been writing down just kind of general goals for both of us. Um, well, really, she kind of relayed hers to me, and so. Um, but of course, it's the new year. I didn't want to be just another, you know, resolutioner. Is, is that what they're called? I don't know. <laughs> Either way, I uh, didn't really want to do that. But this year, I was like, well, okay. I, I actually do have goals, and they happen to be right now, which is the beginning of the year, so we'll call them res. I guess we don't have to call them resolutions. Just goals, Just goals. for the year. So they're goals for the whole year for me, but obviously there's milestones, and so you kind of set milestones that go maybe just a few months out, um, and that actually uh, creates that, okay, well, I finished this one, what's the next one? Uh, so that's kind of my mentality. Mm -hmm. I always have to complete things, and once I'm done with that, like I, I attain that goal, and then I'm, I'm like, well, that was cool. What's the next goal? And I create a new thing. Uh, it's just kind of one of those things. Like it's just never ending for me. Uh, like that, like I said, it just happened to be this time of year whenever I'm like, all right, let's just create all these new sets of goals. Uh, so long story short. Long story <laughs> uh, long. Actually, long story long, really, because there's more <laughs> to it. Uh, I'm, I basically so came up with a few things. Well, we goals. came up with a few things. And we're putting them out there um, yeah. for ourselves. And then maybe it can encourage you guys to set your own goals. And I'm all about accountability. So with my coaching, my online coaching, I'm there to help keep people accountable. But sometimes it's hard to keep myself accountable. So we're in this together. We are in this together. And for one of these goals, I was actually thinking about setting up a Facebook group. So we'll get to that. We will get to um, that. But I, it's always helpful, I think, for me and for others that I, you know, talked to and worked with, to put it out there. So whenever you have goals, put them out there. Whether it's to your friends and family or online, social media, YouTube, that kind of stuff. Um, you put it out there, it holds you more accountable because you know that other people know about it. So... That's kind of yeah. why I wanted to do this. Please judge us. <laughs> All the way throughout this whole time. <laughs> so one of these goals, it's like a 75-day challenge. I'm sure you've probably heard of it. Uh, I don't know. Maybe not. I don't know. But uh, ultimately what we're doing is like oh, kind of a, a thing that's mostly body, mind. Um, and then what I put is also uh, hair, which I guess is part of body. Uh, <laughs> but I'll get to that at the very end. <laughs> Uh, but ultimately, yeah, I'm starting with just kind of getting healthier. Um, ever since my, my leg break, I felt a de decline. Obviously, at the very beginning, there's a huge decline, right? It's just my whole leg, just all the muscle just escaped somewhere. I don't know where it went. It's just, it was just gone out of that one leg. And so, obviously, I stopped walking, stopped doing my cardio. Uh, I was a big runner. I liked running. I liked doing everything with legs. Now, it's just uh, I'm getting back into that. I'm starting to run again. I ran a mile without any pain for the first time um, since the leg break. I, I've done that twice now, uh, but I did that for the first time, I think last week or maybe two weeks ago. Um, obviously, if I can't even remember, <laughs> uh, I don't know, it was been a little bit. So I, I definitely need to throw more cardio in, uh, which kind of brings us to, to this whole side, just kind of building our, our body back up um, or breaking it back down. I really mm -hmm. don't know how, how to look at it really. Um, I found out that I gained 20 pounds but I'm not sure about that because, like, I think I lost muscle and then gained fat, and then now I'm gaining muscle, and then I weighed myself. So I think it's more like I gained 15, roughly. I'm just kind of throwing random numbers out. Either way, there's a. I used to be at 165. I don't care if you know, a girl never tells her weight, you know. But uh, <laughs> so I was 165 for the longest time. I was like, I didn't matter what I did. I, I can work out all I wanted to. I can eat all I wanted to. I was 165. You're dwelling on that. I can't that. get over that. Yeah, yeah. You know. <laughs> I don't mind if y'all know. I was 165 for the longest time. And now I'm actually stuck at, like, well, actually, I'm not stuck at anything. It's, I was at 180, 180 last week and then 185 <laughs> this week. I don't know. It's it's all over the place. I can't control it. You don't understand why. I don't get huh? it. Why? Yeah. 
And so that's that <laughs> also brings up anything. that too. Yeah. So um, <laughs> I'll just jump right into the challenge. And I think what what Blair will do is probably you know with the whole editing magic throw some maybe a little content up here or something. Graphic. Yeah, graphic. Let's call mm -hmm. it a graphic. Uh, with all the details of the rules, you can definitely Google it. There's uh, several other people with blogs out there that, like, the number one result, at least for our territory, uh, was this guy. He, he did it. and uh, So that's kind of how I learned it. Do you want to talk about it? Here, so you, you, you brought it to my attention. brings us to our first goal. This is the first goal. It's it's a lot of it's little a, goals in one, one it's big a, basically thing. basically a 75-day challenge, and it's to hold you accountable, not only to your physical and fitness goals, but kind of mental goals because it's it's mm. definitely a mental challenge it's called the 75 hard challenge and basically what it is i'll lift list it out it's two workouts per day uh 45 minutes one of those workouts has to be outside every day even if it's raining and so and as far as the workouts go we can loosely base that so you know if you're not going to the gym if you're not ready for the gym and if a workout for you is going outside and working in the garden that's your workout like count it just some type of activity two workouts a day one of them has to be outside uh one gallon of water per day which is something i've always tried to do but it's been a lot harder as a mom sometimes i forget to drink water follow your diet of choice for 75 days with no cheating so this is where it's up to you if you follow paleo diet if you follow keto diet or whatever your diet is follow it for 75 days Carnivore. i do flexible dieting um 75 days no cheating so just being consistent for 75 days and read 10 pages of an entrepreneur or self-help or self-development book per day and take a progress picture every day and that's the challenge yeah and so what i'm actually doing to attain these goals is well i mean obviously try to stick to it like the mental side is it's true it's it's very difficult i mean yeah you start out strong and hey you, you make it one week that's a big accomplishment like um but the thing is just keeping that going after that um because you're not going to have anybody really i mean maybe you can get a friend involved and you can do it with a friend uh in fact the workout buddy of mine were um not her you know a different one uh, I think he might actually jump in and do it to a point. Uh, mm -hmm. He's it's it's amazing that he's even in a gym right now. So uh, we're kind of uh, motivating each other a little bit. The way I'm actually holding myself accountable is I I'm using my fitness pal, which is one big thing. Same. And then the other thing is uh, Fitbit. So uh, I can actually put yeah two things <laughs> yeah. Uh, so, so yeah, um, Fitbit actually, if you connect it, which we found out, I think last night, <laughs> we were able to connect the apps. They talk like this. My chart, like it tracks my steps, which today it's pitiful. I've sat in a chair all day and that's another thing. I have to get up and start moving. Th even this reminds me and I still don't do it. Um, and so I have to hit those active hours. I mean, really with this, you only have two active hours. It's just the entire hour is like active. So uh, even if it's just walking, so we plan to walk with Eva, um, mm -hmm. all kinds of stuff. Now the track on this, for the most part, it'll tell us also, my fitness pal, how much more I need to eat, I guess, in a day. So it'll add on those calories that I might need. Um, and so the biggest thing is just finding out what is going to work for you, first of all, mm -hmm. and then you stick to it. Mm -hmm. So make the plan mm -hmm. first. I mean, I'm just, I'm like trying to coach y'all. Really, I'm coaching myself. Um, so I got all these apps to work together. I'm already starting even though we haven't started, right? So the 75 days has not, it. yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm yeah. sort of easing into it. I'm actually, actually I'm, I went all in already, um, but I'm already failing on certain parts. And so it, it kind of makes me able to do it. Like I, I know what I need to maneuver before I could actually start that 75 because I don't want to jump into it immediately and just fail. And then automatically I'm like, well, I already screwed up the first five days. I'm actually, adding five and then I'm starting 75. I think we're starting Monday. Yes. Okay. That's what I was waiting for you to get to. <laughs> yeah. Monday, February 3rd will be the official start that we jump on. Uh, I'm planning on doing a Facebook group that I'm hoping that he can post more on. And so if That's you're on Facebook, <laughs> if you're goal. on Facebook, I'm going to link the <sighs> Facebook group below. And basically it's just going to be an accountability group. Um, I know a couple people already from the gym that are going to be doing this from our local gym. And so I'm going to get them in it. Uh, we're going to be in it and we can post, you know, like little motivational quotes, post what book you're reading, post your workouts, just accountability. So this is another thing that really, really helps for 
myself and for clients. Um, just any way, like I said, that you can be accountable. And if you have a little group of people doing it with you, then that makes it even better. And it actually makes it kind of fun. So we can cheer mm. each other on, all that good stuff. One thing that's not listed on this, uh, what do you call it, the rules on this one that's actually listed online is in parentheses, like it says no alcohol. I don't see that I'm on okay there. with that. Yeah. Done. But I mean, I was already doing that. So Done. I was at least <laughs> going a 30 day run without alcohol. You know, it's like a lot of people are doing like no alcohol mm -hmm. January or I don't know. Let's Whatever do it. it was. Let's do it. So yeah, let's do it. You always do it. <laughs> so you're already there. Um, but that, that's big no, no, for me. No, no, I just mean in general. Yeah. Like all uh, so, of this. Yeah. So that's, that's massive for me. Um, just because, you know, I enjoy it. But, uh, and it's a big part of Texas. There's so many little microbreweries and they're fun. But it's only 75 days. Either way, that's the body side. That's the first goal. And the rest of the goals will be in another video because this one's gone on long enough. But we would love for you guys to join us in this because I think it would be really fun. And like I said, you don't have to make it super intense. So adjust it to what your fitness and experience level is, what your goals are. Walking yeah. is a great workout. You can walk twice a day. You know, just keep yourself accountable for that 75 days. Find some books that you want to read. And we've also added in that, um, you know, watching videos and listening to audiobooks count as well yeah. and I would say at least 10-15 minutes of those you know so kind of form it to what you want it to be but hold yourself accountable for those 75 days and that's why we're going to have the Facebook group so we can keep in touch with you guys and you can keep in touch with us and we can post about our progress who mm. knows maybe we'll post I know I'm going to post um progress pictures at the at the very end on my my fitness pages but maybe we'll do that in the group as well so we'll see yeah, this is, it's going to be tough, but I think it's going to be really good because a lot of the people that I've heard feedback from said that it helps them to build a good structure. And then it, I mean, it toughens you up mentally because you have to stick to a schedule. We've got to figure out when we're going to get the reading done and get the workouts done and that part's adjust that around for me. It's the workout Eva for me. and right. work. So yeah, we're doing this around yeah. a very tight schedule already. And so if we can do it, I promise you that mm -hmm. you can do it mm -hmm. unless you have two kids. Or three. Oh, good luck. <laughs> <laughs> 75, impossible. But if, but if they're older, you can get them to help yeah. you. Yeah. So. Yeah, so yeah, well, you know, not everyone's going to have a little eight-month-old. So. I keep staring at the reflection um, in my glasses. But please post what you're actually watching. Uh, I mean, in, yeah. in moderation. We'll, you know, we'll lead watching, the way in the reading, Facebook group. So on. We'll lead the way and make sure. I'll, I'll get him to post. Heck, you could post daily. I probably will. Post what you're reading. Post your workout. Yeah. Post... You're getting to one yeah. of my other goals. So Okay. Yeah. So we're going to, that's it. That's it for this video. That's it for this goal. Uh, hopefully you guys join us. Like I said, the link will be in the comments in the description. So y'all, if you're on Facebook, join us. Join us in the group. I think it'll be a lot of fun. Maybe we can make it like a, an annual thing or a, a bi-yearly thing. Is that a term? Yeah, maybe. Bi-yearly. The next bi one is the 70... 150 hard? I don't know. <laughs> 365! Yeah. <laughs> okay, that's Lord. it. Uh, hope you guys join us. Hope y'all are having a good day. <laughs> and we will see y'all in the next video. Alright, y'all have fun out there. Bye. Turn the camera What'd off What'd you there. say? What'd you say? Huh? I said, I said the, video, the video made me hungry. Nachos? <laughs> I'm about to go have nachos. Not they fit in my diet, so it's like, it really just, just pick your diet. <laughs>